Hey guys, welcome to me reacting to Ask Mario EP7 Bankruptcy Blues by Slick Frame. Now, I have not seen this, but this was requested. Now, I I checked out Slick Frame's channel. I've never reacted to them before, but apparently they're like a comic dub channel or something like that, which I've never never really react to any of those. I've seen some of them and they're okay, I guess. It's fine. Most of the time it's really just taking other people's comics and then just narrating them and then getting a ton of views off of it. Uh, but you know, it's not like I'm doing somewhat of the same thing. But uh, yeah, anyways guys, reaching to the description, make sure to slick frame and excel description. Let's get right into it. Coming to you live from the Mushroom Kingdom, it's Ask Mario! Jeez. <laughs> ah. Hey, welcome back, everyone. Ah, Mario, hi there. Yeah. What up, players? No time for Yo. a lengthy intro. Bowser. Let's get right into the questions. Who died and made you president? Yo, funny. Let's begin. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I, I have something to say really quick. Fine. What is it, Luigi? Okay, okay. Uh. Oh, Dang it, I forgot. Give me a minute. Wow, how lovely. It'll uh, come back. Okay. Bro, we still got dozens of questions to do. Let's go. All right, all right. I, I'll br bring it up in case I remember. Uh, I, after you, Slick Frame. Wow. You got it, dude. Oh, so he's like another character? Eight has a question okay. for everybody. Do you know who Nabbit is? Can you... Oh. Oh, so this is a Q&A. <laughs> this is a Q&A video. Oh, I couldn't tell by the title. I actually couldn't tell. Uh, I guess that means that this video is going to be edited down a little bit more because a lot of the times Q&As are very formulaic and it's just, you know, one question, question after another and they have like a segment. So if I just find any of the segments boring, I'll probably just cut it out. So if you want to watch the full video, uh, you know, obviously that link is in the description and you know, you should go watch it. So, uh, yeah. Us any information about it? Nabbit is, uh, odd, to uh, say the least. Yeah, I agree. I don't know much about him. Why is he invincible to Bowser's minions? Why does he kidnap toads? Nabbit is one of the most mysterious well, he's invincible to everything. characters ever. Playing as Nabbit is just playing baby mode. Come on. Anything about that you don't guy. play as Nabbit. Are you serious? What? You really don't know who that is? Do you? That's obviously my son. Look at that cloth thingy with the jaws. Notice any resemblance? Duh. I mean, have you ever seen Junior and Nabbit on screen together? Uh, yes. We have. Oh. Uh. <clears throat> well, uh, he's, uh, okay. obviously a rabbit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ubisoft would have been credited if that were the case. Oh, Mario, maybe he's another version of he you. He said rabbit? I thought he said rabbit. In disguise. Uh, spoiler alert for a different game. If you even know we... Which one I'm talking about? <laughs> what? Whoever I is, don't. We can all agree on what is it a fan game? game? When Probably Nabbit not. In Smash Bros. Nintendo hates those. What do we do? We form a truce. And he freaking dies. Yup, he dies. Seriously, that is cheap. Could hear him. I'm sorry, I, I don't know how to say that correctly. Um, Dude. Dude, that's so relatable. I'm terrible at pronouncing names. You know, I'm glad that I even got like slick frame right. You know, that that, that was a doozy. I mean, that that one I didn't know uh, how to pronounce. So good thing, good thing uh, this video confirmed that I was correct. But yeah, the, the, reading channel names and like people's names sometimes is so hard, and I just struggle with it. So this is very relatable. To everyone, what are your favorite Pokemon? I like Snivy. It looks like Trogdor and Yoshi had a child. I like okay. Centret. That thing's Tanuki tail is cute. <laughs> okay. uh, time between Chestnut and Turtonator. They're attractive, like me. And maybe Blastoise. Yo, Bowser yeah. be so sad. All right, our friend That's has funny. one more question for us. Mario and Luigi, how does it feel to sadly know that Alfred 
stream, the guys that make the Mario and Luigi games is going bankrupt. They are? So okay. This is an old one. What? No! Is this guy for real? Wait, you didn't know? This happened over a year ago. Luigi's stuck. <sighs> yeah, it's true. But, but I, I never got a sequel. Uh, th 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 does, does this mean Jeez. from now on okay. it'll be nothing but Paper Mario? My name won't ever be in an RPG ever again? <laughs> <laughs> Damn, they're crying there. Good guys. Gotta cry about it. Yeah, it's I guess. Okay. <laughs> Easy for you to say. Yeah, Mr. Mascot Glory Hog. I'm going to ignore that. Okay. The Superstar Saga is over. <laughs> guys, guys, it'll be fine. They, they can always find another company to pass on the torch. Why are you talking about the Olympics? In a time like this, you heartless freak! Wow, so funny. <laughs> There's a spider on my mic. everyone. And I'm literally not even freaking fine. out. Oh, I just... I think... Paper Luigi? It'll never get greenlit. <laughs> Come here, buddy. Bring it in! <laughs> Dang. It is kind of saying a little bit that the fact that I got more interested by a spider on my mic that I just blew off. To be honest, this this video so far isn't terrible. I could see people enjoying it. It's, you know, it's okay. It's one of those videos where you have the guy just, I guess, drawing all of the characters and then editing all these images together to make it seem like movement. So, yeah, and then narrating over it. So, yeah, it's one of those videos which is fine i'd say the voice acting isn't terrible it's the the quality is good but i'd say the accents kind of annoy me a little bit but they're they're fine it's trying to be accurate to the the actual accents except bowser's that one's just like deep voice and that's really it uh which i don't know i just kind of find that annoying but the other two it's like mario and luigi yeah, fine. Close enough, I'd say. Close enough. It can be a little bit annoying, in, in my opinion. How did you and Peach meet? Oh, I met the princess the first time I rescued her. 1985 okay. 8-4. A decent question, I guess. Tell us me just by eating a mushroom. Those were weird days. It took a little True, time for us to become a couple. We had to get to know each other and spend more time together before we fell in love. <laughs> Slowpoke, I fell in love right from the moment I laid eyes on her. Whoever said you shouldn't kidnap on the first date clearly doesn't know jack about women. <laughs> uh, Yo, Palsy. What you're talking about is uh, <laughs> infatuation. You can't truly love someone until you become friends first. The heck are you talking about? I think she's super hot. She makes me feel all warm and fuzzy inside of her in the manliest way possible. And, uh... Therefore, it's love. Yeah. Yo, Have so you funny. Ever been Bowser's in a softy, but he's not, you know, it's he's not me, supposed to be duh. funny. We just spent a lot of time apart. No thanks to you. It's a long distance thing. We're still working out the kinks. What the heck is going on inside that brain of yours? Is world peace possible? Where did we come from? Is there life after death? Just another of the great mysteries of our time. What? A son. Where did that come from? Assassin. Fletchcar. So, sorry, I don't know how to say that. Dear Mario and Luigi, do you prefer life in Brooklyn or life in the Mushroom Kingdom, and why? <laughs> the Mushroom Kingdom, of course. Oh yeah, by far. Why? The sooner you two move back, the sooner all of my dreams can come true. Actually, I can't even remember all that much about... Brooklyn. Yeah, the, the original story is that we were born on Earth and ended up stumbling through a pipe into the Mushroom Kingdom. But then they retconned that with Yoshi's Island. Apparently we were born here instead. I remember us rescuing and meeting Princess Peach for the first time back in 85, but 
I also remember that we knew her and Bowser as babies? Our lives are weird. You think Nintendo had one of those men in black guys try to, you know, erase our memories but we slowly regained them over time? Nah, it's just inconsistent lore. I True. Don't think it too seriously. I don't think they can. <laughs> one minute I'm made of paper, then the next thing you know I'm teaming up with myself made of paper. And I have the memories and consciousness for both of them. Our lives are weird. Yeah, what? Oh, wait, 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 wait. I finally remembered what I was going to ask you earlier. Did the arcade Donkey Kong take place in Brooklyn or New Donk City? Oh, okay. Bro, I haven't the slightest idea. I don't know. Every I don't think it's New Donk life. City, though. What does Mario think of your ghost hunting skills? Oh, that's easy. Mario thinks I'm... Uh, what? Do you think? Yeah, what? So it's more of a question of Mario than Luigi, to be honest. the only one I know. Huh? To be honest. Uh, what about those Miis from Nintendo? Yo, that game is lit. Right. That game is lit. Yeah, that game is so lit. Yo, Ghost Go, Ghosty Go, that, that game is so lit. Honestly, I could go... I, oh my Just god, that game is so good. You're that game is one. so good. Mario Party Chase is also a great game. Nintendo Land is There's just a great game, honestly. If that gets ported to Switch, that'd be awesome. Probably not, but that'd be cool. Despite these uh, crippling fears, <laughs> it's a you. Aw, thanks, bro. I love ya. <sighs> Tech boy, you got a barf bag? I sure could use one now. That being said, I wish Egad would give you some more advanced gear. I don't want to see you get killed by a Reaper again. Ooh. Oh, don't remind me. Oh yeah, the Smash trailer. That stage without having a p p p p p p p panic attack. <laughs> uh, greedy. You get panic attacks when you can't decide which flavor of ice cream you want. G g g g g gold medal ribbon or g g cookie dough? Oh, it's so much pressure. Dude, cookie dough, obviously. Okay, so honestly, uh. This video wasn't, uh, I don't know, it wasn't, I don't think it was enjoyable, it's not my kind of thing. The, I feel like Q&A videos aren't really my kind of thing, but I mean, sometimes they can be enjoyable. I just think my problem with it is that it's, you know, a guy acting out as like three other characters that are already a thing and technically they don't exist, they're video game characters. It's just kind of cringeworthy in my opinion, but I could see why people would enjoy it. I can see why. I can see the appeal here, 100%. I, I'm not saying like, why do, why do people watch? Like I could understand it. I, I, I'm not questioning why people watch it. I could see the appeal. It's not terrible. The editing is pretty good when it comes to like the still pictures. It actually does simulate movement and the, the images are drawn very well, to be fair. I will say that. The audio quality is good. It's just, I don't know, the accents kind of make me cringe a little bit. And some of the jokes, I think, aren't really that funny, in my opinion. Some of them are, though, but <laughs> unintentionally. But, uh, yeah, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the fucking video, subscribe my channel. See you next one. Bye!